everyone. Today we are going to be going over Yamaha's 2023 all new model. Yamaha decided to discontinue the 21 foot series. So now they've released the 222s, all the 22 foot series. So you'll have a 220, a 222S, and now the 222X, and also a 222 Fish. So today we're gonna to be going over the 222S model. So we're gonna give you the ins and the outs and a walkthrough. So let's get to it. So before we hop in the boat, I do wanna talk about a couple more things about the transom redesign. So not only do they give you the wet sound speakers here, they also give you the swim up radio, which is really easy accessible for you when you're swimming around. You can just switch the channel, turn up the music all from back here. Also with the 222S package, they do come with the uh, reversible submersible seats so right here you will have the brackets for them and they do give you the little seat cushion to pop in here let's lock it in so we can use it as a seat now so now we're gonna flip it over slide it back in this track gives it a lot more versatility here in the transom either using it as a seat or your tabletop so that way it gives you a little bit more engagement back here so while we're in the transom, we're gonna talk about how they redesigned it back here. So they give you a little bit more room here on the platform and also, also on the seating. So they've now went to the snap-in seat cushions that slide on this little track. And then under this compartment, of course, you will have your clean-out still. And they did do a redesign on the clean-out ports on this model. They're spring-loaded now. So it's just the same thing. You'll pop them in and lock them. Um, so make sure when you're on the lake, you snap your seat cushions back in so they don't fly out on you. So let me do that real quick. And then they also added storage behind your seat cushions here and they do go all the way down. So it just gives you more storage for um, your wet ropes and anything you want to stay contained in here. Just gives it a lot more room to give you more versatility back here. I also want you to take a look at the single level cockpit entry. So before they used to have a little hump you'd have to step into. Now you just have the capability of just walking right into the cockpit. So it makes it a lot easier for you guys and it just gives it a more elegant look. So now that we're in the cockpit, we're gonna get ready to launch. Um, but first I'm gonna go over a couple of things. One little thing I do wanna point out is that when they did the redesign, they also redesigned the whole seating arrangements. So as you can see that they did a whole new seating on the seat cushion. So they gave it a sleek back and then this one won't have a bolster, but your driver's seat will have a bolster. Just gives that driver just a little more visibility of when they're looking across the lake. So in the new redesign of the 222, they made this storage compartment here just a little bit bigger. They tried to redesign it like the 25 foot. So you can see that this compartment's just a little bit bigger, gives you a lot more storage. You also have your glove box and the lockable glove box. And they also added a wireless charger here. So super convenient. That way you, can, you don't have to use a USB. All you will have to do is just place your phone on here and then it will start charging your phone. So over here on the starboard side not only did they move the connect screen from the middle of the, the dash but they moved it to the right side just to give that driver a little bit better experience and then they added a wireless phone charger right here so that way you can have your phone propped up and charge all at the same time so that way it's just a little bit easier for you and then of course you will have your joystick here on your on your left hand side turns up your volume, you'll have your no wake mode over there, your cruise assist, and everything like that. So we're gonna get everything ready, have our driver take us down to the water, and then we'll get to it. So we just launched the 222S. We're gonna take it for a spin. This boat's beautiful, so let's see how it does in the water. 